around the wall and centering from the left wing corner. And that was Chapu. And then broken up back the other way. Vandevelde for Akison. For Cousins. He scores! <laughs> Terrific passing. Leaving into the zone. Vandevelde to Akison. Found a wide open Nick Cousins. And he just powered it right through Mike McKenna. One run, nothing Phantoms. <laughs> Terrific game. Out of the point. And a shot! Shots eat the knee off from Yandani. Rebound goal from behind the goal. Banked it in. And Springfield scores. I think that shot came from behind the goal in the left wing corner. And maybe off the back of Donnie or off the back of a defenseman and bounced in. I think that's how it went in. 8.50 to go on the third. And a shot and a goal. From the top of the left wing. And Springfield has tied it. On a goal where maybe Yandani was screened or it was deflected or something weird happened from the left point, really. 2.47 to go in the third and a 2-2 two two tie. A shot, bad save, rebound, great save. Rebound again, Aliardi missed it high over the shoulder of Yandani. For the first one, Aliardi denied on a terrific uplight kick save by Yandani, keeping this game tied at 2-2. Two two. Cousins with goals in back-to-back -back games. Curls over to the right ring. Now he comes in. On McKenna, and he flips it in and scores. He just nicked it in by hole and shot it, I think, when McKenna wasn't quite expecting him to. A yeah, nice deception on the hands of Nick Cousins. This is number 27, Cody Golubeff now. Slowly over to the left circle and scores. Five on Yandani. Drifted in casually. Adirondack gets the one standings point here in this game. In six rounds in the shootout, Springfield wins by a final score of 3-2. to two.